Well, founded on inclusion and creativity, Gallery at Gumbo intertwines an art gallery and barber shop in the heart of OTR. Opening last week, the space and idea is all centered around the name and the melting pot that is Cincinnati. WLWT News 5 Today anchor Colin Mayfield takes us there. If you've ever had or maybe made gumbo, chances are you know the ingredients are what makes it unique. The same type of thought and care were put into a new barbershop in our gallery space, Gallery at Gumbo, which is aimed at inclusivity. I haven't seen really any upscale barbershop that really involves the whole community like this in a while. On the corner of 13th and Main, the space draws you in with large picture windows showing off the art on the walls and the art happening at each chair. Well, my first step is just to, you know, listen what the client wants, you know what I mean? And then uh, try to make him feel his best, leaving the chair, leaving the shop. The gallery plays off the melting pot that is Cincinnati, stating right when you enter the door, the intentions of the space inside. Each barber creates a masterpiece with clippers, like an artist creates something magical with a paintbrush. Artists giving inspiration to the barbers, bridging the gap between radical but transparent conversations paired with a side of art. Use the brilliance of local Cincinnati artists to be the vehicle to drive those conversations. The first collection in the gallery shows the black and brown faces of OTR and showcases will rotate every 90 days. One piece captures the historic events of a summer in Cincinnati packed with protests for justice and equality. The reality you know, is that artists they have a ton of art just sitting in their basement or in their living room. We need those on the walls. We need to have uh, intentional diverse groups in this space. This is not a black barbershop. It's not a white barbershop. It's just a barbershop. It's an art gallery. And, and the reality is, is that the least expensive way for you to travel the world is to have a conversation with somebody who doesn't think the same way you do. So all of the pieces that you just saw are on sale and support local artists. Colin Mayfield, WLWT News 5.